Well, hello, my sexy motherfuckers. All right, well, it's been almost a month now since I've actually sat here and talked to you guys. So, hi. I missed you a lot. But I hope you guys enjoyed my new single and the music video that came along with it that came out about two weeks ago. If you haven't seen it, you need to pause this video and go in the description and, uh, yeah, watch it. Uh, 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 uh. I've gotten so good at that. I think my tongue has, like, a six-pack. <laughs> So I've not done a Q&A in a hot minute, and um, yeah, it's exactly what I want to fucking do today, because I know you have a lot of questions about my life, and you just like, you want to be updated, and like, I get it, I get it, okay? And like, I'm here to answer your questions, like, okay? Like, what are you, fucking Diane Sawyer? Like, relax. So I hope you guys know that I don't like to hold anything back, so I try to choose the juiciest, funnest um, questions that you sent in, and if your questions are not in this, I'm sorry, I still love you. And I appreciate you as a person. All right, let's go. What's it like to be a raging homosexual? Um, I don't know what type of question that is, but it feels pretty damn great to express myself. I mean, so to be a raging homosexual, I can never feel more liberated. Thank you. What do you feel like your purpose in life is? I feel like my purpose in life is to entertain people and make music for people to dance to and, um, you know, like forget about their problems and just like fucking party. And yeah. So like, yeah, I love you a lot. <laughs> Do you have a boyfriend? No, I don't. I think I scare the gay people of LA. You know, this is just like a lot. It's just like too much. If you're a bird, what bird are you? A penguin. Cause I wanna fly. Ow, bitch! Clever Trevor struck again. How many dicks have you sucked? Oh my God, Amanda, that's a very bad question. That is not vegan. Would you consider yourself a hoe? Do people think I'm like this? I don't really know what people think of me as, but like, wow, these questions are like really hurting my feelings. Like I've said in the past, I am a virgin. Um, I know it just looks like I'm always craving a daddy, but um, yeah, it's the truth. My friends call me the sluttiest virgin ever because just like the way I act and like talk to boys is just like so scary. For all the boys that I follow on Instagram and I comment daddy on your photo at 3 a.m., I'm so sorry. Was your new single, Get Me Through the Night, written about anyone specific? No, but it was written about a, it was written about a specific situation. So I was at a party, this was like in the summer, like early in the summer, and I was just like, it's been a long night. And you know, I, I think my friend was throwing up in an Uber, and I think someone was like yelling at me over text, and like, I was on the opposite side of town, and I was just sitting to myself. I was like, holy shit. Get me through the fucking night. And I just remember like, saying that, and I was like, I need to get through this night. And I got through the night, and I got these legs, bitch, now watch me walk. Trevor, first time you discovered porn. Um, so I was probably about like, 11, and uh, I was at a sleepover with my friends. You know me, just doing boy things. Yeah, like I, I used to actually live on the street with 40 kids, like when we were all super duper close, and I still love them to this day. Hi friends, if you're watching. And they're like, we should search up like naked girls. And like me, I'm like, fuck yeah, tits and badge, bro. And it was so funny because I was just like totally like going along with it. Like they just, they told me to search lesbian porn, and like it ended up being, very graphic and like they were using a double-ended dildo and uh, They're like whoa, that's hot. I'm like fuck Yeah, it is it is a little hot in here. Maybe I should step outside you guys could stay here I'm gonna go outside Trevor. What's your blood type? I've always wanted to know this. And I do have an appointment actually coming up soon to get my blood tested because like, I'm, I'm 18 now, I can go to the doctor, I can, you know, just like do whatever I want. So I wanna get my health checked up, stop questioning me. So I think I'll find out within the next couple weeks and I'll definitely tweet it out. I'm literally an open book, I'm about to tweet my blood type. I hope I'm like the one that's like universal. So like if somebody is like, needs my blood, I'm like, bitch, have it. Oh wait, don't they like not let gay people donate blood? I'll just like walk up and tell them I'm not gay. Like they can't tell. Do you still have your depersonalization? Uh, if you guys don't know what depersonalization is, um, it is an anxiety disorder where you are like kind of detached from your brain and your eyes and like it's mind fog and you kind of like, it's, 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 you just need to research it. It's kind of hard for me to explain, but yes, to answer your question, I do. But I have learned my ways around it. I have a great group of people around me that uh, help me with it. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm doing, doing pee good, guys. I'm doing pee good. Opinions on these clown sightings. 
Bitch, I, I don't know if it's like dumbass people putting on clown costumes, but the ones of like the people in the car and shit is like, why aren't you running them over, girl? All right, last question. Have you ever had a threesome? Baby, I haven't even had a one sum. Wait, whatever the fuck that means, but no, I haven't. So, all right, guys. Well, I hope you enjoyed my Q and A today. Like I said, go check out my new single and the music video that is with it. It's in the description, and I really hope that you enjoy it. All my social medias are in the description as well. And if you can give this video a thumbs up, that'd be everything. So thank you. Before I end this video, I have a couple announcements that I have to say really quick. To all my LA fans, I'm having a show at the end of this month. All the info will be in the description. Um, I hope you can go. It'll be awesome. Next, I have a few more signed campaign posters to give away from all your favorite YouTubers from the These YouTubers Have Something to Say video. All you have to do is just follow me on Twitter and I'll be tweeting more info about it. So yeah, you can win a signed poster from me and all your favorite YouTubers. <laughs> also, I have new merch. Look, there are pins. Shook, Rainbow, Trevor for Prez. Get me through the night. I mean, it's it's kind of everything. But lots of new merch is coming. But yeah, go check it out before it sells out. Um, oh my god, that sounded so cocky. Do it. All right, guys, I love you so much, and I will see you next week. Bye.